now we just need to find him a foster or a permanent home that has a fenced-in yard, that has high fences, because he can jump pretty good, but these are six-foot fences, so he, he won't jump over these, but also preferably a doggy door to go in and out of the house, and we found out that he will mark his territory inside the house, so he needs somebody with the patience to uh, give him the time, train him, and he's going to need somebody with a lot of patience, so and probably with someone with no other animals, like dogs or cats. So he needs to be all the attention to him. He loves attention, and he doesn't like to be without us. Even with this new uh, foster that he had for a night, uh, he clung to her too, so. Um, he's never tried to bite anybody or anything like that. And he's getting really good. She doesn't even growl anymore at me, so. He growled at her the first uh, first night, first well, the first time we were there. But uh, he was only there one night. But that's all. I mean, towards the end, he wasn't growling. He adjusted pretty quickly. He's getting more used. To it. it was a learning experience for him, learning experience for uh, us too. So we know we know a little bit more about what he needs. So that's the concept. <laughs> and he's getting used to other animals being around too. This foster had, uh, she had like nine or ten cats and uh, uh, he didn't really like the cats at first, I don't think, but he started to adjust, but I still wouldn't uh, trust him around cats yet. Or he just needs somewhere that he doesn't get overwhelmed with stuff. Out, Show him his neck. Oh. He'll turn around. I don't know if you can see his neck or not. He's got... <laughs> <laughs> He's got scarring all the way around his neck from that trucker collar. All the way around. But it'll probably grow back in eventually. But you could feel an indentation even where it was. But you don't have any more, do you, buddy? Do you? Yeah. <laughs> He's a good boy. He's a sweet puppy dog. Very appreciative. Very appreciative. So we could find him somewhere with a lot of a lot of land be really nice. He says, don't go, don't go. He likes to lean against me. <laughs> 